Hello everyone, my name is Super, Destiny Enthusiast, and today I want to showcase the Stasis Glaive build. Let's break it down. Let's start with Aspects and Fragments. For Fragments, you're going to want to put on Whisper of Rhyme, Whisper of Conduction, Whisper of Fissures, and Whisper of Shards. For Aspects, you're going to want to put on Ice Flare Bolts along with Glacial Harvest. This will grant you an overshield while increasing the radius of your Stasis Shatter, which will allow you to spread your Stasis effects easier. Now, let's move on to the mods. For mods, you're going to want to put on Elemental Charge, along with Elemental Shards, to become charged with light whenever you pick up an Elemental Well, or a Stasis Shard. Then, you'll want to put on High Energy Fire, for a 20% damage buff, along with Elemental Armaments and Bountiful Wells. And then, that is all you need for your mods. However, if you want to take this further, you can add Energy Vampirism, along with Suppressing Glaive, to take this a little bit further. And, if you want to make it champion-oriented, all you need to do is add Unstoppable Glaive, and you're good to go. Now, let's move on to exotics and exotic weapons. For exotics, you'll want to put on Felwinter's Helm to apply a debuff to enemies whenever you get a kill with your melee or a finisher kill. This will apply a debuff in the surrounding area. This debuff is a 30% debuff, the same as Tractor Cannon, but it's pretty much a helmet. The exotic you want to pair with all of this is Agar's Scepter, to freeze enemies and to buff your glaive's melee attack, and then that's the whole build. So, how does this build function? How does it work? Well, you freeze an enemy with Agar's Scepter or your abilities, and then attack it with your glaive's melee attack to shatter it, and to spread your stasis effects. This build is all about buffing your glaive's melee attack. Whenever an enemy is frozen, it boosts the glaive's melee attack by 120%. When you add on Felwinter's Helm and High Energy Fire on top of this, that can boost it by almost 170% per swing, assuming the enemy is still alive, of course. This method is called Ice Pick. The method is my own design. This is a very close range build, so you'll want to be careful when facing exploding enemies. That is the one caveat to running this. Now, I'll have some footage for those of you that want to see and watch how this build performs in close spaces and actual harder content. With that said, my name is Super, Destiny Enthusiast, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye bye